I'm John Greco. I live in Rye, New York. I'm married to Melissa. We met on uh, Match.com, and I saw that John had just rescued a dog, a boxer, and this drew me in right away. My whole um, plot and plan worked perfectly <laughs> in that, you know, you rescue a dog and then you find your life partner. Melissa and I uh, do a lot of things together. We do a lot of training and swimming, biking, running together. We also just enjoy it's the simple things in life, like cooking, taking walks, traveling. It's really nice to have that person that you can just completely relax around, be yourself. We are each other's best friend. January of uh, 2015, I went for a typical uh, annual physical with my, my doctor. He noticed that I had a prominent heartbeat in my abdomen. I had multiple aneurysms and they were significantly sized. My reaction was a bit of panic. Uh, John was the more level-headed one. I was just worried uh, that it was a life or death situation. He looked at me and he said, I want you to know that you'll never be able to run again. I went from being completely healthy and thinking nothing was wrong to uh, finding out that I had a life-threatening situation. We both were shocked and we both were, you know, thinking about what are the next steps. So having a visit with the head of vascular surgery at a prominent hospital in New York, he explained to me that there were a couple different approaches that could be uh, utilized. The procedure is a partial procedure. It only addresses making sure that you can live, but it doesn't address or provide you with full blood flow to your lower extremities. I really saw in black and white all of the risks associated with each of these procedures. The risk of um, paralysis, of a lot of complications down in the nether regions, it's just was very, very um, depressing when we read those. I want to enjoy with Melissa the things that we both love to do together. You know, traveling and being active is a big part of our life. Fortunately, I, I did come upon Cornell Hospital and W.L. Gore had the study at Cornell Hospital and that study uh, was focusing on a solution that would address all of the issues that I had. That's when Melissa and I had that conversation. This is the right solution. This surgery enabled me to not only be alive, but to be able to live our lives together. We were both so impressed with the, um, just the commitment to quality of, of all the people that we encountered. And the dedication during, of the, the people. De the dedication, and you can tell that they really are invested in, um, and Not doing what they did for John, improving people's lives, preserving their quality of life, saving lives. There's no difference that I feel now than prior to the surgery. My life is 100% complete. Being able to do anything without limitation is a wonderful feeling. The possibilities are endless. <laughs> <laughs> I think the decision makers should recognize that there's more to medical care than saving someone's life. Many doctors could have saved my life. But I think the life that I would have had was not the life that I wanted. It's providing them with the life that they want to lead. Thank you for using your technology to, to produce this device that, that not only saved my husband's life, but preserved the quality of his life. <laughs>